happy to see one of my favorite students grant, even if it's just for a short visit. <laughs> and especially one who's done so well in his future endeavors. <laughs> the staff always knew that you were going to excel. <laughs> Doing my best to uphold the tradition this place taught me. Mm, well, you just let me know if there's anything else that I can do for you to make your stay with us more productive. <laughs> oh, Vaughn, will you show Mr. Wheeler where to find his brother, Marshall? Good to see you. Likewise. Grant Wheeler. Oh, you have your name on a few of those. I I'm Vaughn, one of Marshall's friends. Marshall has a lot of friends? Yeah, sure. I can take you to him. After we give you a welcome back tour of the school, Grant. Actually, I didn't graduate that long ago. I think I still know my way around. Oh, no, we couldn't let you. Absolutely not. <laughs> Josie, Marshall's a how? Let's go. Aside from Marshall, what brings you to Blake Holsey High, Grant? I'm uh, interviewing for a summer internship at a company close by. A summer internship? At a company close by? That will look so good on your resume. Really great experience towards future work opportunities. Yeah. Look, uh, who are all you guys exactly? Corinne Baxter, Josie Trent. Lucas Randall. And you're all friends of Marshall's? Oh, well, yeah, of course. Totally. totally. Isn't this where the tour started? Uh, yeah, uh, but uh, uh, you just let's seen, go. Uh, the <sighs> Don't worry, Marshall. I'm sure we'll think of something. After all, an aptitude for chemistry runs in your family, right? Part of the family. Grant's one with the brains and, and the and the looks and the talent. Yeah. And the. From what I hear, your brother won the Zuckerman Science Olympics twice while attending Blake Holsey. Another thing that he's done better than me. Okay, no, I'm, no, okay, thanks, guys, thank you. But I really want to go find my brother now. Hey, have you seen the new tree? Yep, they planted a new tree out by the parking lot. You should see it. It's, it's, it's really very... Green? So you've seen it. <laughs> Why are you guys trying to keep me away from Marshall? Did he put you up to this? No, it's just a tour. Come on, let's go. Come on. <coughs> I smell like a swimming pool. What is happening to me? I'm afraid you've become chlorine. What made that happen? You did. I think we've made a connection between your feelings about your brother and your newly volatile relationship with the elements of the periodic table. We have? And I don't think it has anything to do with magnets or music, does it? I didn't think so. But if you've become chlorine, what's that other one? Oh, oh my god! I'm covered in... What is this? Uh, don't panic, we can explain. You can explain this? No. We better get Z. <laughs> must be sodium. I, I mean, Marshall's brother. And you are? Professor Zachary. I think there's someone you should see. <sighs> Will somebody please tell me what's going on here? After. For now, maybe we should leave you two alone. You two need to talk. Are you sure they should be together? I have a theory. What's happening to me, Marshall? Same thing that's happening to me. We're becoming uranium. How? According to Professor Z, there's bad chemistry between us. Bad chemistry? About what? Look, you've been this way with me since last summer, Marshall. What's going on? Is this because I broke that stupid keyboard of yours? Stupid? That's why I've become sludge? Your stupid keyboard? See, there you go again. It's always about you. I worked two whole summers to save up money for that stupid keyboard. I didn't know it was so important. 
That's the thing, Grant. Whenever it comes to how I feel, you, you never worry. I said I was sorry. No, you didn't. Of course I did. Well, you didn't mean it. Look, I've said I'm sorry, OK? So what, what's this really about? At this rate, they're both going to have a nuclear meltdown. Grant, since you've been here, I feel like I've been living in your shadow. Everybody loves you. <laughs> your friends led me in circles around the school this morning because they thought that that might help you, Marshall. And you're complaining to me? Me? People like my music. I'm sure the teachers like me, but I never had real friends like that. Get out of here. Of course you did. Now it was popular, but there's a difference. I could never get beyond them liking me for what I could do with a keyboard or how many trophies I won. None of them knew me. I was always jealous of the great friends you could make just by being who you were. <laughs> Even when we were kids. Yeah. Today it just proves nothing's changed. Why, why didn't you say something? Ah, probably for the same reason we never really talked before now. We thought we knew how the other guy was feeling. Alkaline metals always form one-to-one -one compounds with halogens. Your sodium atom is giving electrons to my chlorine atom. Making sodium chloride. Table salt. Two unstable atoms combine to make a stable molecule. Do it again. from the looks of the atomic models. <sighs> You'll be happy to know that Marshall and I are finally back on the same page. Not to mention atomic number. But if you think that means this is over, think again. <coughs> oh, you are so dead. <laughs> this is so awesome. You're the new lead singer of Magnet 360. Hey, and I'm not forgetting who helped me get there. Thanks. <laughs> Gotta go, Marsh. I'll give you a call when it gets settled. Does this mean that if you ace this job interview, you'll be moving here? We'll see, but that's the plan, man. Mm. That's my future boss. Victor Pearson? Yeah, that's the guy I'm interviewing with. What would you be doing for him? Not too sure. It's a starting position at Paradigm Industries. Victor starting up Paradigm Labs, and my brother may be employee zero. That that could be a good thing. Or not. 